the Karuma Hydroelectric Power Station. This 600 megawatt hydroelectric power project is located on the Victoria Nile, downstream of Lake Chog, and 2.5 kilometers north of the Karuma Bridge. Karuma Dam is the 14th largest underground power station in the world. This is because its electrical mechanical installations are located 100 meters underground with 26.5 kilometers of underground access loads. The construction of this dam and power station officially began in August 2013 and it is expected to start commercial operations this year 2023. The main contractor in this project is Sino Hydro, a Chinese state-owned company with Alstom supplying equipment and technical services to the power station. Karuma Dam project is tagged at 1.7 billion US dollars that was sourced from the Exim Bank of China. This project is operated by the Uganda Electricity Generation Company Limited and owned by the government of Uganda. Karuma Hydro Power Plant technical specifications are a compacted concrete gravity dam that measures 20 meters high and 312 meters long. The dam has six water intake towers, each measuring 20 meters high and 29 meters wide. The underground chamber with six vertical Francis turbines of 100 megawatts each, measuring 200 meters long, 21.3 meters wide, and 53 meters high. Why is this project so important? This project is in line with Uganda's Vision 2040 and a National Development Plan that identifies need for the construction of hydropower plants for economic development. The objective of Karuma Hydro Power Plant and its transmission lines is to increase power supply in the country and the East African Community region. This hydro power plant intends to contribute towards increased power supply, cheaper electricity, increased electricity access levels, satisfying fast-growing electricity demand, and increased generation capacity. Is this project going to serve its objectives? And is this proof that other proposed projects can be achieved? Thank you for watching to this point.